Oof. I was about to forget. Let me call my friend and tell her I am on my way to her place to prepare for the wedding. I know it is a very big day for her, but I hope she can pick. I was... <sighs> Jackson, why did you do this to me? Why did you embarrass me? Why are you always... <clears throat> Whenever I want to do <sighs> something, you are there. Just trying to block my way. Jackson, this time I won't allow him to do the same thing he always do. Because if I do that, he will never, never learn his lesson. Oh, Ellen, I was about to call you. I wanted to tell you that I was about to leave to the saloon, but I hope you'll make it on time. Because if I won't see you, girlfriend, I won't be happy at home. And you know that you are the most important person in my life. Please make it on time. And I hope this time Jackson didn't block you away because always he is there blocking you away whenever you want to do things. I hope this time you'll make it because you have already promised me a lot of things, but suddenly you couldn't make it. But this time I hope you will. Girlfriend, promise me that. That is the only thing I want to hear from you. My friend, relax, Doreen. I won't be late. I am on my way to your house. Jackson was about to do crazy things. But guess what? This time, I manage. We will see each other soon on church. And I promise I won't be late. I know you know me as a late person, but this time, promise you, I'll be early than the pastor himself. Helen, thank you for everything. Thank you, my friend. You're such a nice person. You'll find someone one day, just like the way I find David. You'll find someone who will care for you, love you, and respect you. Girlfriend, you are the most precious girl I ever know. See you soon on my wedding. Helen, you're looking very beautiful. Oh, you're smelling good. Where were you, girl? I haven't seen you for a long time. You look even more beautiful. <laughs> my eyes. Oh my gosh. Huh? You are the most beautiful girl. I'm stuck on you. <laughs> Aaron, you're the most crazy person I ever know and meet. I can admit that. Long time, dear. I haven't seen you. Where were you? Overseas? As for me, I was just trying to fight with my damn life and trying to be a better person more than I was yesterday. How about you? Long time. Huh? I'm surprised. By the way, how are you? I'm so happy you just come to my sister wedding. I got another opportunity to see you and talk to you. I wish and hope for this day to come. As for me, it is my great day. I just meet you, Helen. You know, since the day I left, I always remember you. As for my sister, I'm so happy for her. She met the good companion of her life. I wish her good luck. But what about us? Helen, do you even remember me? Forgot about phone call, forgot about text messages. We are here today. Let the past be the past and let's live the present. Helen, you are here. I didn't know we was coming to the same wedding. If I know, we could come together. Jesse, Mr. Savior, I didn't know you was coming to this wedding either oh i'm so happy to see you on my friend wedding you're welcome who is he it seems you know one another yes i don't know him as mr savior he just saved me from my aggressive man in a short while he was just behaving with me then jesse saved me from his drama 
He always do that. But this time, I tried to walk away from his life. He didn't want. Then, he wanted to create a scene. But I found someone like Jesse, who saved me from him. And I'm so happy and proud of Jesse. Because man like Jesse, I feel. Oh, I'm really very sorry for you. But at least someone was there to protect you. If I was there, I could break his noise because it's very stupid. <laughs> I'm very happy to meet you here. I didn't know it will happen in the same day. Oh, you are very beautiful. How could the man such as him misbehaving with you? You need protection. You need care. You need love, not that such kind of life. You are more than that. Mm. Jesse, thank you. By the way, I didn't know you was coming here. And you know my friend Doreen. Me and her know each other since we was a kid. How did you know Doreen? Is she your friend? Do you know someone from her family? Huh? Oh, that is very beautiful then. I know Doreen. She was my co-worker. But my friend also. I'm happy to come for her wedding. I know she'll be very happy because she didn't expect me to come. I have a lot of work to do, but I try because it is her special day. So why not surprise her? That's why I decided to come to this wedding. But I'm happy. I got another surprise. And it is you. Mm. But how about the guy which... Um, mm, I'm sorry for asking this. But I wanted to know. The guy I find here with you. Who was he? You mean Aaron? He's my friend, long time friend. He is Doreen's brother. Nice to know that. I didn't know if Doreen has a big bro like him. Ah, nice then. By the way, you're looking very beautiful and you smell good, Helen. Very beautiful. Thank you for the compliment, Jesse. I really appreciate it. <sighs> this guy. I wonder what is he telling Helen? They have talked for a while now. Should I go and they talk to Helen and make her busy? So she can forget about the guy, Mr. Xavier. Mr. Xavier, my foot. Does she see I do care for her a lot? Should I give them 20 minutes? If they keep on talking, maybe I should interact. Will it be good and safe for me? But the guy seems he's interested with Helen. Aaron, this time, I won't allow that. Helen is mine. The guy should be forgotten. Let me see. What should I do? 